My name is Kyle Bradshaw and I've been a friend of Don Boyer's for roughly three years now. Right now you guys are sitting in a courtroom in Indiana. Where on the docket is a case where a man jumped in his vehicle, uses a weapon, and killed my friend Don Boyer. Hello all of you at Cruiser Customizing Community. Uh, my name is Copper Guy, or so I go as uh, on the site. Um, some of us have not been formally introduced. It's the great sorrow that I come to you this morning. Our good buddy, Copper Guy, Don Boyer, passed away last night. I was away home from work when he was struck by a van while riding his motorcycle. Oh, <laughs> and he died instantly. Copper Guy was one of our moderators. Absolute stand-up individual. Friend. Fellow biker. Thank you, Don, for all the work that you've done for us here and for all the friendships you've helped us build. Rest in peace, man. For all you fallen bikers up there, if you see Don, say hello to him for us. He's a great guy. Take care. Life is full of decisions and choices. And sometimes, Things you just can't avoid. In the case of the accused, he had a choice to pick up the bottle. He had a choice to pick up his keys. He had a choice to jump in his car. He had a choice to look twice before he hit or used his vehicle as a weapon in murdering another human being. Join me now as I walk you through a little bit of Dawn. Hopefully bring him into this room. Hopefully allow all of you to feel his spirit that he once shared with us on a daily basis. In case you haven't noticed, as Kyle mentioned, uh, when I got the Harley Davidson I did get the Sunny Days package. It's a, a little extended warranty thing. It provides sunny skies, no rain. Uh, you ought to try it. It seems to work. Don will never get the opportunity to get behind the handlebars of his motorcycle. Be able to ride home and give his wife a hug after work. To hug and kiss his kids goodnight. The sky begins to snow, you cry. You're faithful to her in your careless. This grandchild will be raised not knowing who his grandfather was. trip on the Harley, and uh, well, I found something. When I was getting ready to go through the trunk, my grandson, Andrew, apparently stowed away. He wants to go to Canada, too. Sorry, buddy. You're going to have to get out of there. Life has been taken from not only Don, but his family, his friends, people around the world who looked up to him as a role model, as a motorcyclist out there on the roads every day. Traffic, people not looking, people not seeing, honestly not seeing, cause motorcycle accidents every day. I understand that. In this particular case, the accused chose to drink, chose to drive, and then chose to use his vehicle as a weapon, which in this case murdered and caused the death of an innocent person. Let's roll.
God I needed that. Don meant a lot to me. He still does. I think about him every time I get on my motorcycle. This is an extremely hard thing. And what makes it so tough for me is that the man that killed Don could have chosen not to drive, could have chosen to take a taxi, could have chosen to call a friend. Don, rest in peace, my friend. We all hope that justice will prevail. This is of one man took Don's life and have affected the lives of hundreds, possibly thousands of other people. To all of Don's family and friends, Don is a remarkable and amazing individual who was able to touch the lives of people around the world. Okay, this is my first bass through the ice. Uh, Look at that. Absolutely can't complain. I just shot a video a little bit ago about uh, can't catch any fish this year. Uh, what, a uh, four pound test? Uh, you can't beat that. To the courts, I hope that justice will be served. Don, I'm sure you're watching all this go down. I want you to know that I love you and respect you. And I appreciate the friendship that you've allowed me to have with you and with all of your friends. May justice be done in honor of you, Don.